Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Sarah and today I am going to review this lovely long luscious lock style <laughs> which is called Bohemia by Beltres in the color Cola with Cherry. If you want to know how the color is composed, what special features she has, how the cap looks from the inside and how I like her, then stick around and let's get started. these really long, really curly styles. I don't know what it is, but I just love them. And I'm definitely getting Rita Hayworth 1940s vibes from this one here. <laughs> Although, of course, it's not exactly the way she wore her hair. But, uh, you know, the color and the curls and the lengths are just so gorgeous. And this is the first time I get to try not only the style but also the color the reason i'm able to show it to you is that i got this wig as a loan from perukenglück.de my favorite online wig shop in germany that carries all the great american brands and there are even coming more this year i've heard and this one was a return by a customer who didn't like it and so Jan and Silke, the owners, were so kind to send her to me so I can try her on and show her to you and I'm very grateful to them. Thank you so much Jan and Silke for lending her to me. Now, on the one hand, I think it's always interesting to see a style straight from the box, like this one, so you can see how she looks when she arrives and I really didn't do anything to her. I just put her on. I didn't even have to give her a lift because she has a built-in lift right from the factory. And there's also the zigzag part still intact, which I have to leave in since this is going on sale again. And if you're from Europe and watching and are interested in this style, you should check out the link in the description box below. I will link the original style at perukenglück.de because they ship all over Europe. Not worldwide at this time, but within Europe. So in case you're interested, check them out. They really have great and I think even the best prices in Europe. And they often run special sales so you can get a really great deal with them. And uh, check out their sales section and you might even find this one in the sales section at a great discount. So on the one hand, it's great to show a style straight out of the box. On the other hand, I think it's a little bit a pity I can't show you how this can look in all her glory. Since you could comb out the curls at least a little bit with a white tooth comb or just finger comb it and give it more volume and more air and, and movement because these curls are really tightly set straight from the box, of course. But on the other hand, this look reminds me of those glamorous hairdos, you know, of uh, Hollywood celebrities at a film premiere or the Oscars and so on. And I just love those long curly styles. And unfortunately, this one is being discontinued by Beltres. They are no longer producing this style. They are just selling their stock. And so if you like the style and want to have it, you better get one soon because it might not even be available in your favorite Beltres color. I think it's a pity, but I hope they will come out with an improved version of this one in the future in their Lux or City collection, since uh, the City collection have the improved cap features. Now, like I said, the wig is from Beltresa's cafe collection and is being discontinued. And uh, this also means it has been on the market for a while and doesn't have the improved cap features, which means it only has a lace front that goes temple to temple and a left side mono part. And of course, I'm going to show you this from up close as always. And since it has such a great lift, I don't even have to hold the hair away from my face. You can really see the lace front really well. Now, I must say I've never seen this on a Beltres lace front and I think it looks a little strange for Beltres, but maybe that's because all the other colors I've seen had um, very light highlights you know, all the blondes, and uh, this stuff only has some red highlights right uh, at the hairline. 
So the knots here, I think, are very visible. They are not that fine. And also the pattern is very symmetrical. And I've never noticed this on any other Beltres lace front. Um, the density here, I think, is, is done well. And like I said, I can't show you the mono part because of the zigzag I have to leave in. But I think here the seam where the lace meets the cap is really obvious in this uh, style. Of course, with also with the, the dark cap and the dark colors. So this is something I absolutely don't like. And that's the reason why I don't really like wearing those older Beltres styles because you can always see that. And I'm so glad they now have improved their caps to the extended lace fronts. Of course, you can try to hide and cover that seam, you know, by picking a streak of hair and, you know, pulling it down into your face so it covers that. But I'm not a big fan of that. But um, the lace front actually reminds me of a John Renault lace front. They also have that very symmetrical wave pattern on their lace fronts, which is something I don't like at, with that brand either. But of course, you can always pluck the lace front and make it look more natural, which is something I also did with my John Renault styles. You know, you just take a pair of tweezers and pluck out a single fibers right at the front of the hairline and you just give it a more unregular pattern and break up the pattern so it doesn't look that very symmetrical, very straight. And um, this is something that is fixable just as the part that is knotted too densely in most cases at the older Beltres styles. So I really wouldn't bother that much about the hairline, but of course uh, this is also due to the color. Um, I think, uh, you know, the blondes with their very light face framing highlights don't have that problem and you just don't see it that it's not that obvious. Maybe the pattern of in which the uh, lace is knotted is uh, similar, but it's just not as visible. Now, there are absolutely no complaints about the fibers because this style is also made with those gorgeous heat friendly fibers by Beltres, which have always been fabulous and the best on the market, in my opinion. And uh, so you have all the advantages of heat defined fibers. They are not shiny um, and you can use your heat tools to change the style if you like. You could uh, flat iron this and straighten it or add different waves or curls to it if you like. But I personally wouldn't do anything to it um, since I think this is a style with gorgeous curls and not just those beachy waves that everyone else has <laughs> and a lot of other Beltres styles too, of course. So I absolutely love big bouncy curls and this one definitely has them. And another advantage is, of course, if the ends start fraying and getting frizzy, you can always use your curling iron or other heat tools to treat just the ends and smooth out and seal the fibers again so they will look and feel like brand new again. You know, I personally always love and prefer the heat defined fibers and I think Beltres has the best ones. All right, now let me show you this beauty from all sides and afterwards, of course, also in natural daylight. So, how do you like Bohemia? Is she on your wish list? Or did she just jump on your wish list? <laughs> Please let me know in the comments below. I would love to know. All right, usually I would take you out on my balcony, but since it has snowed and there's still snow on my balcony, it's really slippery. And before I break a leg or my neck, is there also the term break your neck? because we use that in German. Um, I will stay inside my living room, but I will open the balcony doors so enough light will be coming in to see this gorgeous color in natural daylight.
So, how do you like the color? Isn't it gorgeous? I think it's a really beautiful warm brunette. Now let's talk about that beautiful color for a minute. It's called Cola with Cherry and has the color code 4 r 6 350. And Beltres describes the color as a cappuccino dark brown rooting with a blend of dark chocolate brown mahogany and chocolate cherry. Okay, well, I've seen some other dark brunettes by Beltres. I must say, this is the one I personally like the best by what I've seen so far. Now, if we have a look at the color codes for a minute, the base color is a 6, which is a medium chestnut brown. And the chestnut brown, of course, has some hues of red in it. And that's why I love chestnut brown, since it has those warm red tones in it. The highlight color, which is the 350, is not even in my list. <laughs> I have no idea what that color code means. I know there is a 345 which is called amber. So I suppose it's also some red tone. It, it's the, the cherry they are talking about. Since amber sounds like a glowing orangey color, I suppose the 350 is more of a strong reddish tone. Now the 4R, which is the root color, is a medium dark brown, or it's also called a basic brunette. And, um, I really think this is a gorgeous color with a lot of dimension. It has a lot of highlights, low lights, and also a root throughout the style. And I think it's a beautiful brunette. All right, now last but not least, let's have a look at the cap from the inside. So here's that cap from the inside. Here you can see the lace front, which is not extended. And then that seamlessly goes into that mono or lace part that isn't that deep here, but you have enough parting space. I think it's about an inch parting space here. And uh, on the sides, she has the felt cover D tabs with the metal stays inside. The rest of the cap is open wefted. She has an extended nape and the typical belt truss pull strap adjusters. So all in all, this is a well-made cap. Okay, that was my review of Bohemia. I hope you liked it and it's helpful. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to my channel so you won't miss my future videos. And there's a new one coming out each Friday. If you have any questions, please put them in the comments below and I will gladly reply. Now, thank you all so much for being here. I really appreciate it. I hope you will. Stay that way and I will see you again soon. Take care. Bye bye. And today I'm going to review. Uh, and today I'm going to review this long, I'm going to review this gorgeous long curly, this gorgeous long curly style for you. And they have the improved cat feet, the improved cat, uh, cat, cat features. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yes, I know. From the City collection and Lux collection, of course, have these great improved cat, cat features, <laughs> cat features. <laughs> I always want to say cat features. Now, if you love long curly styles, you really must check out this one. Or maybe you also like this one. Or just check them out both. <laughs>